tapeworm has two primary hosts, humans and pigs. The parasite larvae form cysts in the muscle tissue of a pig. If a human eats undercooked pork that contains the cysts, they get infected. In the human gut, the cysts hatch into adult tapeworms. The worms lay eggs that are passed out in human feces. If a pig then eats the feces, the eggs grow into cysts in its muscle tissue and the life cycle repeats. The pork tapeworm is a particularly vicious parasite because it can end up inside the most important organ in the human body, the brain. The encysted larvae secrete a chemical that binds to the body's immune cells, preventing them from penetrating the cyst. But if the cyst is killed, it stops secreting the defensive chemical, and the body's immune system launches a massive assault on the dead parasite. This immune response causes the brain to swell, resulting in a deadly condition known as encephalitis. Tapeworms in the brain are the world's leading cause of epileptic seizures. In the US, an estimated 1,000 people were infected last year. Most infections occur in people who have spent time in areas where the pork tapeworm is endemic, such as Mexico, Central and South America, Sub-Saharan Africa, India, East Asia, and the Caribbean. Travelers to these areas should ensure the food they eat is prepared in sanitary conditions and make sure that pork is cooked all the way through. The pork tapeworm is particularly deadly because it can hold its host's immune system hostage. If the host's immune system attacks the parasite, the host could die in the process. 